introduce you to your new defense against the dark arts teacher. Me. Gilderoy Lockhart, Order of Merlin, third class, honorary member of the Dark Force Defense League, and five times winner of which weekly's most charming smile award. But I don't talk about that. I didn't get rid of the band and banshee by smiling at them. <laughs> I see you've all bought a complete set of my books. Well done. Now, I thought we'd start today with a little quiz. Nothing to worry about, just to check how well you've read them. Thank you. How much you've... Uh, Taken in. Look at these questions. They're all about him. What is Gilderoy Lockhart's favourite colour? What is Gilderoy Lockhart's greatest achievement to date? You have 30 minutes. Start. Now! Tut, tut. Hardly any of you remember that my favourite colour is lilac. But Miss Hermione Granger knew that my secret ambition is to rid the world of evil and market my own range of hair care potions. Good girl. Now, be warned. It is my job to arm you against the foulest creatures known to wizard kind. You may find yourselves facing your worst fears in this room. Oh, no, no, only no. that no harm can befall you whilst I am here. I must ask you not to scream. It might provoke them! Cornish pixies? Freshly caught Cornish pixies. <laughs> Laugh if you will, Mr. Finnegan. But pixies can be devilishly tricky little blighters. See what you make of do it. Just do no. it. Oh. <laughs> Come on now, round them up, round them up. There any pictures? A few moments later. Why is it always me? do is catch up with the train. We can't be far behind. Do you hear that? We must be getting close. Hold on. everyone. Good morning everyone. Good morning, Welcome to Greenhouse Three Second Years. Now gather round everyone. Today we're going to repot mandrakes. Who here can tell me the properties of the mandrake root? Yes, Miss Granger. Mandrake or mandragora is used to return. It's also quite dangerous. The mandrake's cry is fatal to anyone who hears it. Excellent. Ten points to Gryffindor. Now, as our mandrakes are still only seedlings, their cries won't kill you yet. But they could knock you out for several hours, which is why I've given each of you a pair of earmuffs for auditory protection. So could you please put them on right away? Quickly. Flaps tight down and watch me closely. 
You grasp your mandrake firmly. You pull it sharply up out of the box. Got it? And now you dunk it down into the other pot and pour a little sprinkling of soil to keep him warm. Uh, Longbottom's been neglecting his earmuffs. No, ma'am. He's just fainted. Yes, well, just leave him there. Right, on we go. Plenty of pots to go around. Grasp your mandrake and pull it up. Thank <laughs> you.